hello guys it's Mickey welcome to my channel and if you're just into my channel please subscribe turn on the notification bell so as to be notified each time there's an upload coming from me yes I know it's been ages I didn't even create a video on tea on Sundays last week Monday all true but all the same um, today I was supposed to make something for you guys um, but it's late it's really really late I just felt why not make create something this is 803 past eight in Nigeria actually and um, that will be tomorrow so I'm going to teach you guys how to make um, black soap you know creating into a bar soap okay so I'll tell you guys the measurement of your lye your your, your milk the, re the reason why I didn't do it today was I was short of milk okay because we we're supposed to use our milk but since I was short of milk I felt okay fine you know what I'm just gonna hold on for a while all right so tomorrow definitely we're gonna do it and for people saying, oh, Mickey, the reason why Mickey is not, is not on YouTube anymore is one, she doesn't have the money for the gifts. Are you kidding me? Like, seriously? <laughs> well, I do. But I, I placed order for um, the hand mixer. I'm yet to get it. I already placed order for it. I already paid on Jumia the hand mixer. I'm yet to get it. And um, for the crock pot, hmm, I want the hard though. Because to get a cheaper crock pot, it's really expensive. The person I bought the crock pot from, the dealer, she doesn't have a smaller one. She has a bigger one, which goes for, it's now 17000 The one I got for 13000 now 17000 18 to 20000 So I'm like, whoa, you know what? I'm just going to hold it on there, okay? Because I was expecting it to be like 5000 If I should get it for 5000 I'll probably get like three and give it to good customers that are, like paying customers that are really all through the year you know because we are rounding off we're in december now so all through the year we have actually been a very good and you know reliable customer but all the same i'm still holding on for a while next week is next week or next upper week should be no next week should be the deadline yeah that's when we're going to be doing the distribution i'm going to show you guys the gift and when they get it hopefully i guess some of them will probably create something or probably just send it as um a video or a link so you guys would know oh mickey's not lying because i know some people was like oh mickey you might just show us the pictures but you and i know you didn't send nothing to nobody <laughs> well i'm not like i'm not a two-faced person okay so i'm definitely gonna do it but i just hope they get to create a video and show it to you guys like oh mickey did this mickey did that so to so actually give me more thumbs up but all the same um if per eventual i don't get the um crock pot at a cheaper rate the way i was expecting it to then what i'll just do is give a discount okay so I'm, that's why i'm holding on for a while i'll just give a discount on a particular product you get then we'll give a, a like maybe 30 to 40 percent discount slashed off on the goods so you guys would know oh mickey 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 really loves our customers i love you guys like you you guys are my fans as in eh? and i hope you guys love my new edo I didn't adjust the wig well. It's a wig though. It's not a uh, hairdo. It's a wig. Okay, I hope you guys like it. Well, that's by the way. I'm supposed to answer some questions. I was supposed to answer some questions on Sunday. I did not answer some questions on Sunday. But today, I should do some answering. I don't know if I look good on the wig and the glasses. I can't help it. I'm getting old. Okay, so, um... No, someone um, wrote a message saying... Wanga Negus, nice boo. Can I use boiling water and any oil? Which boiling water do you mean? Which which cream? What do you want to make? I don't really know. Which shower gel do you want to make? Um, do you mind match you? Hello, Mickey. Can I mix whitening ampoules and collagen ampoules together in one lotion? Yeah, people do that. I've seen people do that. They do. They really do mix collagen and whitening ampoules together. Yeah, you can. Um, Kyra Liu. What oil do you use? Should I mix both this together with the oil? What do you mean by both these together? You want to mix QI with Bedon? That doesn't make sense. They are both base creams. They are hard creams. You can't mix them together. That would be sounding absurd. You know, you get a secondary cream. A secondary cream are creams that are what you like. They are not base creams. These are base creams. You know, solid creams are base creams that are very difficult to get out. You have to get a secondary cream a secondary cream being um, totally liquidated it's been um, made into more like an oily lotion but not completely an oily lotion that's most mostly like a secondary cream or if you don't want to add your secondary cream into it, you can just add your additives into it and you know 
mix it together. I hope you get the additives correctly. And um, what's a key to can't find half of this stuff. Which of the stuff? Whitening shower gels. Which of the shower gels? The only one you could probably not find in Nigeria is Ombia shower gel. The other ones you can definitely find them in Nigeria. Ombia shower gel is really really scarce. You have to go to an to an American store to get them. It's really really scarce. And someone says she has Ombia shower gel. She's selling it, but the one I want, she doesn't have it. So, um, Messi Jacob, please, how can I contact you? I guess I gave you my um number. I guess so. Read the ben Bentley. Wonderful video, Mickey. Do you offer training? Ah, uh, yes, I do. But for now, you know, I'm mixing cream, going here, going there, going there. Today, I just had time to rest. You know, even after packing some goods for people, I still had. I just had time to. I slept all through, starting from um, 11 a.m. down to past six. I, 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 I didn't take pills. I was so surprised how I slept off that long. I was so so tired. I was supposed to deliver goods today to God is good. Since I slept all that late, I'm like, okay, you know what, I'll just do it tomorrow. So, um, it's because I don't really have time on my hands. And most times, even when I do training to, for just one particular person, the products are expensive. Okay, so getting a group of people together is not really that easy. Some people are like, oh, it's too expensive, let me just go for the ebook and all that. But even what is in the ebook is also the same thing we're going to do in physical training. It's totally the same thing. Okay, but I was thinking of creating, um, I already have a website. I was thinking of creating a mobile app. Okay, so the mobile app would instead of you coming, oh, I want to learn physically and all that, going through the stress, driving down to come see me, or me driving down to come see you, and um, all it just takes is for you to go to my mobile app. When I create it, I'm just thinking of it. I'm thinking of the idea because I've thought of it, and I'm like, okay, would this help? Would this help people? So what the mobile app is just gonna do naturally is. Um, it will give you segments of where I get to mix creams live. I get to mix creams live. So I get to put them. It's just like Iroko TV, you know, Iroko TV app where they get to bring out apps. Like they get to bring out new videos every, I think every Monday is like four, three times a week. Yeah. So I get to bring out new videos three times a week. They are going to be segments, segment for your face creams, segment for your body wash, segment for your body cream, your scrubs, your your acids, how to mix uh, your peeling oil, apart from the peeling oil, I mean, how to mix your whitening peeling oil, how to go through a spa, how to do some things, exfoliate your body, and all that. So I was thinking of creating that using my mobile app. So I just get to make it, mix it, do some things, and you guys get to see it. It's, though the mixtures are definitely gonna be different from that of my YouTube channel, because YouTube channel is just a free, you know, free recipe. So the mobile app, you, you guys are just gonna pay for it. The way they pay for, um. Um, Iroko TV, but a token, so it's just strictly gonna be like that. I don't know, I just need your ideas. People who are business oriented on my YouTube channel, come in here and talk to Mickey, okay? Advise Mickey if it's gonna make sense, all right? So, um, I was thinking of doing something like that, okay? Then every week I get to bring out two to three videos one face cream, one body wash, one body cream and one body wash then another week i might probably just give you body scrubs i might give you oils glowing oils body oils you can add it to your creams you know i, I was thinking of doing it on, with my um mobile app with a mobile app when i create a mobile app so the mobile app is going to be friendly using your ios that's your iphone and also your android i was thinking of doing something like that because it should definitely be you know eye-opening so instead of you going for physical training, you just get it there. Whatever you want, after paying for access to watch it, you guys just get to, okay, this is what we're supposed to do, this is what we're going to mix. People who even purchase my ebook who probably do not understand some things in the ebook, do that, could also go there and see how they mix a particular thing, how you get to do it, and the results you get to get. Okay, so that's that. And um, the, the, most, the most tests... Um, my lotion, that's her name, the most test. <laughs> that thing that's um, like AKA. I think so. My lotion but, slash butter is just made with shea butters and oils. No water. Should I use e wax new to creating recipes? Yes. If you actually want to make a uh, user emulsifying wax, or better still, beeswax. But in this case, if you're using e wax, uh, you can still. You, add water well in this case you can use beeswax okay beeswax is actually very good 
it's just that people who are new into cream making and all that you might not know how to make use of beeswax because if you add water into it, it becomes gunky and it doesn't make sense but if you decide not to add any water into it why not why not just try out beeswax it's really really good you can just try out beeswax your shea butter and your oils and it's really form it's just gonna take it to get taking used to you know you have to get used to it when you get to use your your beeswax because it's more like a wax wax not really like emulsifying wax but emulsifying wax you need lotion and all that but for emulsifying wax you probably need you definitely need water to help you know boost it up open for you you really need water to help shimmer it for you okay so um we have louis gordon mickey beating the table making noises hard to hear plus speaking too fast for so for some to comprehend things well that's that's the problem i'm sorry i talk fast when I talk slowly, I forget some things. But when I talk fast, I grasp everything together. Because you know I'm not looking at anything. I'm not right. I didn't write anything. I'm not looking at the script and telling you what to do. I'm just telling you the questions you guys are pulling up and how I'm mixing a particular product, what you should expect. I'm just telling you from my head. So when I tell it fast, I, I get to grasp some things in my head together and just say it. So I think you should probably try and work on my pace. I'm so sorry. I talk really, really fast. I wish you could talk to me on the phone for some time. I talk really, really fast. I'm so, so sorry about that. All right. Recommended. How to make Snow White's um, X5 whitening cream. Okay, that's for someone else. Sorry. Um, we have... Um, okay, this was a recommended video for me. I, I haven't subscribed to this channel. All right. Salome King Gamba. I want to make a half cast lotion. Okay. Um or Gichidera. Make it skincare. How much is the blue one? Um the blue one is approximately I think it should be on my website. You should probably go check out the price on my website. Yeah. And um waifu esiosa. Please oh, don't mind them. I love your reviews. Thank you, honey. And um Godfrey Gloria, what can I use for skin tag? Well, I, I think I said on my video one time when I said skin tag. Most times, if you have lots of skin tags on your on your body, uh, what we tend to do is we go we go do home services. That's what we do, because if the skin tags are much, we need home services. There's a particular person that will do the home service for you, and then we give you a treatment to use, and you notice psh, it's all out. Okay, so um, Godfrey Gloria, Mickey, you don't have to explain yourself to anyone. Shop or not or not, you are making your money. Yes, I am, honey. But, um, you know, sometimes words do get to people. But I've noticed, you know, I'm just starting a female's business. I'm just le learning that. In a female's business, you have to just learn to ignore words. Ignore words. And sometimes someone will just call out of the blues. You know, because it's, it's a business line, so you have to pick it. And when you pick it, the person will be like, bitch, and just switch off the phone. I'm like, are you kidding me? <laughs> Sometimes it's just so funny, I laugh out. And sometimes it's just call um, Madame Ovasabi. Now, wow, switch off the phone. And I'm like, who the hell was this? Uh, they get to use private numbers. That's why I don't pick private numbers anymore. Because I feel if you want to discuss business with me, why should you be hiding your number? It doesn't make sense. Okay, so, um, Rabi Omotayo. Please, dear, I need your WhatsApp number and I want to buy some things from you. I think I gave her my WhatsApp number. Ade Gunde Samson. Is anyone, is anyone know the best? That was the way he wrote it or she wrote it. Is anyone know the best like this rooms for knuckles? My knuckles are very bad. I need your help. It's funny. You know, someone even contacted me saying I should recommend something for knuckles. It's funny. Um, You know, you know, when people get to say, good things don't come cheap most times try and invest in your skin most people find it difficult to do that uh, i don't want to do it because it might not work you don't say that it's just like going for a prayer you know people who actually go to, i'm not a church person though people who actually go to pray you're going to pray for faith you're going to pray for something you want from god all you need is faith now nah, because that's not what they say you need your faith to work for you because your faith actually makes that prayer um um, affirmative so I don't know how you get to make creams and besides my knuckle recipe people have actually said yes it has worked on me 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 for 10 to 20 people saying it has worked on me it has worked on me come on honey it does work 
for you saying I should give you the recipe for free. I'm not going to do that. You want it for free, go get it somewhere else and get your hands more damaged. Because when you want something for free, I feel something that, you know, when you're good at something, you don't do it for free. Because when you even do it for free, how would you make a living? That's what I feel. How would you make a, how would you make a living? Because most times people just tell you, ah, I can just teach you for free token or teach you for free. You notice now rubbish they still teach you. But that's by the way. So um a big one day something, you can't get it. You can't I don't think someone is even gonna tell you. Even people who have learned too, they know they spent money to get that information. It will be so unfair. I don't care if someone gives him the information, but it won't make sense. Something you make money, you have to utilize or gives your brain. Nigeria economy is really bad now. So giving something to someone for free these days, ah. Like that's when you know the person even has the money to purchase it. It doesn't make sense. It really doesn't make sense. Sandy Beauty Peeling. Thank you very much, Mickey, for this recipe. Very helpful. I confirm this works. I use the same ingredient for my peeling oil. Just add TCA to make it more effectively. And it works very well. Thank you. You can see now. You guys are telling me my recipe is the work. So it doesn't, you know, someone be like, oh, the peeling oil she did didn't work. It does work. It's just that you need a certain, it's not just any soap you need to help you in um, removing the, you know, after staying for three days without taking your bath, you need to neutralize it. So what is going to, what you're going to use is a particular soap. You need a soap to do it, not just any soap. It is a particular soap that should help in doing that so that you don't get to damage your skin. It's a particular glowing oil because during that three days period when you actually added your peeling oil, you know, someone asked me a question. She, she said she wanted to do the peeling, but is it for three days she keeps applying the oils? No. You know, like, let's take for example, today I want to peel, okay? Let's take for example, I don't peel, I don't like it. So I want to peel, I just want to peel today. And um, if I start in the morning, or probably I'm just starting now, I have to use rubbing alcohol first, okay? It's better you go take a bath, wash off, dry your body very well. Then you apply rubbing alcohol on every part of your body. After you've made your, your peeling oil, apply rubbing alcohol on every part of your body. Then you start applying your uh, your peeling oil all over your body. Okay? you When you still have more, you keep applying it. Every 15 minutes, you keep applying it in order for it to sink into your skin. So you keep applying it every 15 minutes for that day. Then after that day, you're done applying your peeling oil. You're not going to apply it the second day. You're not going to apply it the third day. So you're done. What you're just going to be applying is, you notice when you're peeling, you're definitely going to be having itches. I'm sorry, it's a, it's a wig. <laughs> you're definitely going to have itches, okay, around you. You probably want to itch. I, I implore you, please, please, please don't itch your skin because you'll definitely end up damaging your skin. There'll be bruises. You would not like it, okay? So... That's why there's a particular glowing oil that should be used or should be applied on your skin when your body becomes dry. Because when you when you're in that period, that three day period, your body will become so dry you would want to itch your skin. So there's a particular glowing oil that would help in, you know, massaging it on that area. You need to massage that oils on the area. So on the third day, you use your soap and you neutralize it. You know, after that, there's a particular cream you should start up with, not just any cream. Because your body hasn't peeled completely. You know, after the three days, you start noticing some peeling will start happening. But I really don't know why some people want to peel, you know. I really don't know. Even the girl that peeled, though her skin is looking good, but not all that good. Because still not as good as mine. <laughs> Even though after she peeled. I didn't peel. But that's why everybody with their choice, okay. She, that's her choice. She wants to peel. So, Alitza Granville. I love this. Thank you. Nancy Gomez. Oh, yes. Dodo lotion is the worst of all. I'd used it. I'm not going to talk about a bad lotion anymore. Because I feel um, when you talk about it, the product, the manufacturers might just, you know, definitely it's their business. They want to protect it. But at the same time, these are loopholes people are telling you. It's just like there's nothing, even for glutathione, as advanced as glutathione injection is, it has side effects. The side effect is whitening. Everybody knows that. And that's why people abuse it. In any product, you can't tell me there's no disadvantage in a particular product. It's a lie. It's a lie. These are different. We have different skin. You know, how my skin reacts to a particular cream differs with how a part another person's skin reacts to another skin. 
with, to, to the same cream we both used okay and we both have different skin but you can't tell me a particular product can't do this to a particular skin it's not possible you can't you can't tell me that you can't say you made a particular cream when it's not a base cream it's a cream that has been mixed with additives not all skin would be able to take it not all it won't even work for all skin that's the thing not all skin and there are some skin that are too sensitive that that cream will be too harsh for even without adding any oils any serums or the rest but we are telling you your loopholes honey all you just have to do is check out your loopholes and try to cover it up that's how it is you know it's business people will definitely bring out um, criticism that is how business is done without criticism you can't get better in life that's what I just feel um so um blessing Mandia I love you I love you cuz you say the truth yeah and it's trying to put me in trouble thank you <laughs> and um, Matem Matem Babela I like that name Thanks, Mickey. Still waiting for the black soap virus. Yes, it will come out tomorrow. I'm going to do it tomorrow. Unfailingly, the, uh, the uh, ingredients are ready. The only thing where they cause the backlash now, the... Um, um, sorry, the milk. Yes, it's the milk that is causing us to have backward, whatever. I would have done it today. But I noticed there was no milk. Because I want to add milk into mine. You know now. So, um... That's by the way, and um, there's also someone who said, uh, Zarina Irene, thanks, Mickey. What if I use rose water? Do I need to put preservatives? Don't like that thing, yeah, honey. You have to try and like preservatives. Almost everybody doesn't really like it, but you need to, as long as there's water into it, you should try and put preservatives. Try, okay, because um, yeah, rose water is good, but rose water can't keep it for long, it can't. Because also water and it's been preserved on its own, but you adding it into an additive, adding it into a lotion will definitely trigger it to want to get spoiled quickly. So you could just add your additives, okay? Your preservative, sorry, I said additive, preservative. <laughs> um, Geraldine, lovely honey, thanks. And Jela Chine, thanks a lot, you're welcome. Naji Lovett, good job, yeah, thanks. Queen SK first commented with a thumbs up. Thank you. Quincy Quincy. Um, Bem Rose. Your skin really looks good. About the oil. Can I use it before I apply my lotion, please? We're talking about body oil. Yes, you can. But when you want to apply your body oil, you know, body oil is different from glowing oil. Like glowing oil that has recipes that are because most people get to mix it up. That have like maybe you have like your industrial oils not essential oils or carrier oils now people who purchase my ebook will understand what i'm talking about the oils in your ebooks are not the oils you apply on your skin directly i am begging you don't do it you can apply it on your skin directly when you're peeling okay because you need the whitening out of it but right now on your skin after taking your bath your body's a bit damp no you need essential oils because essential oils will help in calming your nerves because you're definitely going to add lavender oil and mixing it up lavender oil or chamomile oil whatever oil you want to add into it will help in calming your nerves okay your rose oil will help it's a nutritional oil to help in rejuvenating your skin regenerate regenerating your skin cells and all that well you if you probably want to add argan oil you want to use almond um, avocado oil you want to use almond oil you want to go all the way to add almond oil there are, there are carrier oils that are, argan oil is good for all skin type, almond oil is good for all skin type. Avoc avocado oil is actually very good for aging skin, mature skin. Okay, so these are the oils you use to shimmer your skin when you want to use it. Like probably after taking your bath, you'll be damp, you want to apply. These are body oils. Okay, industrial oils are not body oils. They are not body oils. Where you get to talk about um, Clair Magic Serum, don't do that. Those oils contain harsh chemicals that might not go well with your skin so please 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 even essential oils that are not suitable for your skin will damage your skin talk less of industrial chemicals please 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 okay don't apply it directly on your skin you put it into a cream after mixing it you put that into a cream but your essential oils your carrier oils you can apply it directly on your skin because they are safe um now someone said Quincy Quincy Bemrose again. Um, who's this? Again, another one. 
Maybe because I probably didn't answer. Oh, she's very rude. You know, I've noticed one thing about female um, business. When you probably did not give them what they want, they get to start saying rubbish. Like, uh, she's rude, she's that, she's this, she's that. Um, I tried answering your question, but I'm going to mute you now. Okay? So, that's, by the way. Okay, I've noticed there was a lady like that when she called. She called me with a... With a she first called with her number and said... Uh, she wants recipe for her lotion. She wants to know the kind of cream to use and what to add into her cream. No, she said she's using Supreme. Yes, that she's using Supreme. She wants to know what to add to Supreme. And I told her, ma, even in my channel, I get to say it. I don't recommend creams to people. I'm sorry, ma. Next thing she was like, eh, eh, okay, but at least just tell me what to put to my Supreme now to help me in boosting its effect so that I can lighten. I said, ma, I already told you, I don't recommend creams to people okay then she switched off the phone she gave the phone i think she called with a different number this time it was a guy that called me asking for the same thing and i told the guy i'm sorry i don't recommend creams to people then she called she texted me and said you are just a bitch what was that for what was that all about you know what maybe when you have your own business or maybe when you started your own cream line you can start giving people free recipes or free advice of what to mix and tell me if you're gonna go far using that just tell me because I've not heard anyone who is into cream line I've seen someone who is into cream business that would never tell you what she used in mixing a particular cream she would never tell you rather she would just tell you okay you know what go and bring two million amount of money you and I know she doesn't even have in her account because she doesn't want to tell you that's it where Percy they see chop you don't you don't try and most people won't give the tips of how to do it but mine is not like that i feel okay fine i've been through these issues i've been through that but i'm not going to give you for free it's not possible it's not possible how can you walk up to me and tell me hey, i want to know the additives to mix into my supreme are you kidding me hey fine why not just go and meet the person you bought the supreme from and tell them to give you added for them to sell supreme to you and tell you Okay, this is the cream to use. They should probably just tell you additives to mix into it. Because that's my belief. If you come to a store, my own shop, and you want to buy cream. If I, if I actually have a shop, you know, and you want to buy cream. And I tell you, honey, you know what? Use this cream. This cream is so good. I should as well give you additives that would work well with that cream. Because it doesn't make sense if I'm giving you a cream, a base cream. And I'm telling you, this cream is very good. Common sense would even tell you, the person buying the cream, that what would I use to boost it or would I add anything to it? Since you're buying for me, I should tell you that. You shouldn't go and meet someone else and say, I bought this cream for someone. Someone advised me to buy it and which additives can I use with it? It sounds absurd. Totally absurd. To me, shall Maybe to you it might, sound, it might make sense. That was the same thing someone actually did to me. Again, she contacted me. She said I sold ebook to someone. I sold ebook to someone that taught her yes I sold ebook to someone and the person I sold the ebook to also sold the ebook to her but she's coming to meet me that I should um, explain it to her and I'm like are you for real are you for real it doesn't make sense how can I go to take for example I school in OAU I'm not going to Unilag to go and meet a lecturer in Unilag without even registering for uh, as in academic session nothing I'm going to meet, meet a lecturer in Unilag and saying sorry I learned in OAU okay i'm coming back to meet you because the person i learned from said he or she learned from me please can you put me through on this does it make sense it doesn't make sense you didn't purchase it from me i feel since you purchased i don't care what anybody does with my ebook because you bought the ebook for me whatever you it's your business since you bought it from me whatever you want to do with it it's your choice it's your choice but i feel for you spending that kind of money in purchasing the ebook you should also utilize money in doing that making creams and all that you should also utilize money Okay, and she she said she sold the ebook. The other girl said they sold the ebook to her. They sold the ebook to you, honey. Ask the person that sold the ebook to you on how to go about some certain product. You can't come to meet me. She's the only one that has the right to meet me, not you. You are the third party here. So and then she started saying, now wow, you sound nice on your YouTube. You're not even nice at all. There's nothing to be nice about in ladies' business. I've noticed since I started this business as in a. Hmm, Ori for me to come in sometimes and when talking to clients you just be feeling headache well that's by the way 
and um Rita Aki Aki Hemen. Mickey, please, what did you mix with your cream? I like your color, your face. Please chat me up. You know I can't tell you what I mix with my cream. You want it, I could probably just mix it up for you. Or you want it, pay token for it. Okay? <laughs> it's not free now. After all, I also pay to get the information. I pay to get information. And I keep learning every day. Because, like, I think from next month, I'm also going to learn all that cream mixing and all that spa and all that so you know some people are like mickey why do you want garlic you already know i don't know all only a fool admits admits to knowing all only a fool admits to knowing all i still want to learn there are some people out there who are just uh you know slow people they don't talk they just keep mute and just watch they probably know better than i do okay i just choose to own a youtube channel the girl, the girl that taught me cream mixing doesn't own a youtube channel and that girl knows like crazy she doesn't just want to have it at all so i'm also going next month to learn some things and um we have god for gloria i knew i know you are from and wait wait i knew i know you from somewhere you are gorgeous seriously thank you where did you know me from god for gloria you better start talking now <laughs> okay Teresa michael don't do any vlog can can they are not in love with you just that okay wait i'm coming i've not seen this okay wait 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 Teresa michael don't do any vlog can can they are not in love with you just want just what you can offer don't mind fake people i love your transparency oh thank you honey yes 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 i should not do any vlog that was even what a customer of mine said she called all the way from Abuja and said, what stupid vlog? Make it, I heard it on YouTube. What vlog? <laughs> said, you want to put your private life in public? Even I know a vlog is not even a private life. It's a lie. Because most of those vlogs, they get to tell you what you want to hear. Because you don't expect me to spill out my dirty linen in public. You know, it makes sense now. They tell you what you want to hear and YouTube ends up paying me. That's the thing. So whatever you guys think, oh, it's a vlog, you're knowing about Mickey's personal life, it's a lie. They are not, most of them are not real. That's the thing. And I hate all this fake life and all that. It's not really my thing. But I will try and do a vlog. Okay, where I'll be taking you guys everywhere. Anywhere I go. So that YouTube will just be paying me money. <laughs> I'll create my second channel doing a vlog. So that YouTube will just be paying me. And you guys will be watching, thinking, ah, so this is where Mickey went to. This is where Mickey eats. This is how she eats. This is what she cooks. Mm. <laughs> Indeed. And um, Teresa Michael commented, Nigerians can be very rude. They are rough mentality. Is is having a shop an achievement? Don't mind that lady, I beg. Keep soaring high. It's pure enviness, nothing more. Yes, yeah, so, Teresa Michael, I'm telling you, people feel... It's by having a shop that you've made it. But I should let you know, even when I was on my address, I were talking. Do you know that there are some people that own a shop? Mm? I'm not just saying it uh, because Mickey does not have a shop. She's defending herself. No. There are some people that own a shop that in a day, let me know, in a day, self will take water. In a month, eh, they cannot own up to 10,000 naira. They won't pay 10,000 in a shop. Eh? They can't tell you maybe they made up to 10,000. So it's not by shop, okay? It's not by shop. It's what you do. You know what you do and you know how to do it best. People will come crawling for you. Even if I want to own a shop safe. Ah, I already told you people now. There are some things I... There are some budgets with they done. I have to budget some things before owning a shop. Because when I own a shop, my problem will even be times five or six. Yes, because people will come and complain this, that and all that. And again, the issue of the lecturer hasn't really dissolved. So that someone will not come to the shop and pour me acid over that professor's case. That is the reason why I'm backing down a little bit and not being in a hurry. Okay? But right now, I'm not safe. That is the word. Okay. So, um, honey, to own a shop is not an achievement it has never been and it will never be an achievement okay how much i take to my master's degree i think it was probably up to roughly 300 plus that's enough money to even get a shop okay so um 
Geraldine, nice one, honey. You're welcome. Leggies, leggies. You are the bomb, Mickey. Love you, pieces. Thank you, honey. Um, Josephine Jewel, nice one, Mickey. It's the time. We have to watch the time. Rabi you more tire. Mickey skincare, please. Where do I get all this ingredient, especially the acid? Ah, uh, you get it, Nojota. I already said that. Ojota, Ojota. Mahasa Kahan is golden face cream triple action good for face does it have side effects yeah it's it's actually i won't say it's a bad cream it's a good cream because it works for a certain skin people with normal skin they roll well with uh golden face but people with sensitive skin like mine no you definitely have cellulites you notice cellulites all over your face it won't look nice so it's really good for people with normal skin you know they get to notice that ah golden face is good though even when mixed with la 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 you notice it removes your redness for normal skin but for people with sensitive skin hmm don't go close all right so um and um, rosalyn ragp and uh, make it skincare just to commend you for being honest in your reviews and explanation at least no matter what there is always a good in everyone no matter their shortcomings yes my shortcomings is the anger issues i mean i know and i'm trying to cut it off but it's not working because i don't know if it's really working it's a bit though a bit all right so um Bright or day, my wife's face needs help. What cream will she use to get rid of sunburn? You and I know that you can't get that for free. That's like an information which causes a token. Cynthia Michael, much love, Mickey. You are so honest. You're welcome. Augustina Otasoe, I think she's an Edo girl. Wow, we are from the same place. Oh, we are from the same place, are we? I'm an Edo babe, but a lost Edo girl. I was born in Lagos. I live in Lagos. I've never been to my village. So I don't think we're from the same place. I might probably share Edo Edo, but <laughs> I don't hear my language. I don't know how to speak it. I don't hear it. I don't I guess probably that's why I'm different, you know? I guess so. Um okay so um then um I got to that Otasue Mickey skincare smile not really Please, can I have your number so I can write you on WhatsApp? I have something to talk to you about. I visited your online show and I'm interested in some stuff there. Okay. Rosaline, RAGP, Mickey Skinky, I love, I, Mickey Love, please can you give review on egg yolk toning field cream? Should one add any lightning additives or use alone? Please, how do I get your knuckle remover and how much? Thanks. I think it's, yes, I want to get my um sticker. Yes. So when I start making my cream, I'll just put a sticker and I'll put it on my um, website. That's I get to have that problem a lot. People are like, oh, Mickey, I want to order, but I I've not seen on your website. Is am I gonna order? Because mostly my orders, I, I get to make it before I deliver it to you. So I want to make it like keep it on my website and all that. And the peeling cream, and not the peeling cream I showed you, peeling cream that would help in lightening your skin. I would put it, a set and everything. I'll put it on my. Um, website I'll put a sticker on it and um, you guys will see it but the sticker won't contain my face I don't know how it works a sticker with a face is good though but I just feel it doesn't make sense does it I don't know okay um Ogai Adams I love you too like Kilo Day you're welcome honey and um Queen K fresh Mickey Skinker like seriously what was it like seriously for <laughs> I really don't get Queenette um christy goldie christy gold kai girl i love you just the way you are oh thank you and um queen ak fresh a bad joy your body is not smooth enough i thought as much you forgot you forgot to tell us your age and um, also not the friendly type don't like to keep friends just do my thing my own way i was thinking i am the only one you're not the only one anyway already shewani on shabba shabba i think that's the yoga word <laughs> when friends have they have do you away well so you just decide to stay alone honey loneliness no the key person have you heard that loneliness kills it doesn't know and i tend to enjoy my space probably because i get to read novels you know and now safe as i'm mixing cream no time to read novels so i get i'm i'm a novel lover and I, I, I read novels even when i was in school all true i don't really have friends so i read novels they're like oh she's a loner i'm not you know makes gives me time to think you know think of ideas how to make money how to do particularly give me ideas okay and um yes my yoruba is not small but i was born in lagos okay and i schooled in ife so i schooled in a yoruba setting and all that because so i had I had a little bit of knowledge of yoruba and um my age what do you want to use my age for i'm a boy i'm a boy <laughs> 
I'm not telling you my age, K Frosh. And um, Blessing Brown, oh, thanks for doing this small intro about who Monica is. Funny enough, you describe me in person, laugh out loud. I've told you before in my mind, you're my friend. Waiting patiently for that vlog. Well, yes, I will do a vlog probably on my second channel. You guys would, but well, that vlog, I'll try and get some tells, try and scrap some things, like maybe when I'm mixing cream. I know that's what you are trying to get. When Mickey is mixing cream, she'll be showing us what she's putting inside the story. <laughs> I will scrap that part. It's not going to be there. Because now start to wait. Mickey, where do you live, please? Eh? What? Why? 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 I live in Lagos. I live in Lagos. Um, sometimes I, I actually go to people's homes. I do home um, services. So sometimes I do that. Um, I will grace. Nice one, Mickey. I'm really enjoying your video and would like to chat you up privately. How do I get your phone contact? I think I gave it to her. Patience, Chine. I, the video is long because I have to answer some questions. Thanks, Honey, for answering my question. I'm just waiting for... I'm watching you for the second time and I'm really liking your channel. Thank you, Prudence. Thank you, Glory Elenda. Keep it up, girl. Thank you, honey. Leon Faith, much love I got for you, Mickey. You are the best. Thank you, honey. And, um, you're my day, Omo Bolanle. Please, Mickey, I'm using QBI and I used to mix with White Express oil and the tube is really, is it good like that? No, but you just said, please, Mickey, I'm using QBI and I used to mix it with. That means I used to. You're used to mixing it with white express oil and the tube. Why are you asking again? I felt you've been using it for a while, and you said you like it, or is, or is it good like that with QBI? Yeah, most times people get to mix QBI. It's when you mix QBI, you get to see the the um, effectiveness of the cream. Okay. It's okay if the tube goes well with you. But hope you know there are some skin that don't con that don't like clobetisol. Some skin don't take it. They don't take clobetisol. Okay? But if your skin takes it, why? If you have a sensitive skin, clobetisol re reacts well. Clobetisol reacts well on my skin. Because I have a sensitive skin. So, um, Lily Ama, review on X5 and Gluta Gold Fade Milk. Okay, I'll try. Leon Faith, hello Mickey. Please, can I mix rapid white lotion with kojic acid powder and rapid white oil together? Rapid white lotion with kojic acid powder and rapid white oil together. Um, I don't really know what you're trying to achieve with it. Slash out the kojic acid powder. You can use the rapid white oil. The rapid white oil will help in lightening you a bit, but not all that. And um, you don't get to notice green veins. That's why I like rapid white oil. It's a very good oil. You won't notice green veins. It doesn't pop out the veins. You know, there are some oils or serums that bring out green veins. That's why I said you should scrap out the kojic acid powder. Because it might not roll well with rapid white oil. Okay? So scrap it out. Use the rapid white lotion as well as the rapid white oil. You can add other additives, but don't use the kojic acid powder. Okay? Because it might not really go down well with you. But if you were using it with uh, maybe a cream from the scratch or a cream that you want to pick it up, you can. But not rapid white lotion. Okay? Alright. So, um... Lily Ama, first to watch, but quite unfortunately, you didn't answer my question. All the same, love you, honey. Lily Ama, which question is that? Golden properties, second to what? Comments, okay? Now, so much love. Now, so much love I got for you, babe. Thank you, honey. Anna Casey, Mickey, please, what do you add to your bedon lotion to make it work fast? Then, no, I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> I won't. Anna Casey, big ups, Mickey. First to comment, much love. You're welcome. BTTC, okay, I think I answered this question the last time. Yes, I think I did. Um, yes, I think I did. So I'm done answering your questions. I'm done. Yes. So by tomorrow, there's nothing like unfailingly. I'm not going out tomorrow. I'm just going to make something for someone and that's all. Okay, yeah, I'm supposed to go deliver something at Jibo. Um, that's all. So um, we're going to make our black soap turn it into a solid black soup i just hope it solidifies before then to make sense when it solidifies on time so we get to show you and how it gets ladder up and you guys get to see the ladder and how good it is and i'll tell you a particular product to use in order for you not to have any skin irritation whatsoever okay so um let's see tomorrow i'm gonna make something for you tomorrow it's supposed to be today because on tuesdays thursdays and saturdays we're supposed to make something okay but that's by the way, we're going to make it tomorrow. And I'll try as much as possible to keep up the pace because I've not been making any video of recent and 
it's taking a toll on me it doesn't make sense okay and we're getting close to december yes so mm -hmm. for the packages i promised you guys yes there are some that are already coming in i'm sorry let me get some hold on okay there are some that are already coming in i got um soap i got soap mold for my customers i got and um, measuring spoon i've got some of you can see another soap mold soap mold soap mold and okay and but um i'm yet to get my hand mixer okay it's just the hand mixer i actually ordered it on Jimmy. i'm yet to get it i actually ordered five so the black soup i'll be making tomorrow i'll also give it to some of my customers and also shower gels okay and it's just the crock pot that's the delay that's the thing just the crock pot but because uh, the amount i bought my own crock pot my crock pot is the big one which is thirteen thousand naira. i was thinking of getting a small one which is like five to six thousand naira, like three but i didn't get it because the person that actually tends to sell the crock pot says she has the big one and this particular crock pot of mine that used to be 13 is now eighteen thousand to twenty thousand because of the festive period or so and i tried looking for a small crock pot on jumia i couldn't get it because the last one someone bought it so i couldn't get it i don't know if it will be it will be ready and maybe i would use express line so i'll just get it quickly because by next week i should start giving it out to my customers okay so it shouldn't look like oh mickey's lying and all that no <laughs> so by then i start giving it to my customers and but I really, I would really like the crock pot because I already promised for the crock pot. But if I don't get the crock pot, I will just give like maybe thirty to forty percent discount off a product a person gets to order. All right. So um, when you guys order, if you probably order starting from maybe product worth fifty thousand to hundred thousand, okay, I'll give fifty percent, thirty to forty percent discount out, okay, of your goods. So you notice, ah, make you, make you, make you, wow. That's what I'm just gonna do okay i'm just praying i get the crock pot but if i don't get it that's your alternative all right and um i love you guys like kilo day and i said it earlier i hope you guys love my head bye guys